So we got our Pine Martin in our last video, which was I was super chuffed about. Um, looking back on the footage now, um, something that you may have noticed or you may have not known is that every Pine Martin's bib is um, unique to that animal. So I've noticed about our Pine Martin that we've brought in, it has got a little chip on its shoulders, which is going to be great because it's going to be easy to identify. So we're going to name this guy Chip. And uh, any time we catch him in a camera trap because of these markings, we're going to be able to know if it's him, which is really exciting. It's going to be able to, uh, interesting to see if another one comes in, all that sort of stuff. So we're going to know if we have different animals. So it's been a bit of, about a month since uh, my last video um, was made. So I'm going to have to start putting the peanuts down again for him. I'm going to go out tomorrow morning. It's given to go down to minus two or three. Um, which is going to be really cold, but it's also going to mean it's going to be a beautiful frosty morning. And I love filming in uh, this sort of weather. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get up with the crack of dawn. We're going to leave some peanuts for the pine martin. We're going to leave the camera trap again. And then I'm also going to take a walk around with my video camera and see what we can get in uh, this really frosty morning that uh, has been forecasted. So we might see some deer. God knows what you're going to see when you're up early in the morning. You never know what what uh, is going to cross your path so really looking forward to it so until then we'll uh, we'll chat to you then alrighty so hey everyone it's uh, tomorrow morning or this morning and it's absolutely Baltic it's minus four uh, so the forecast was not wrong there's a hard frost over uh, over everything it's crazy that these animals have to take the brunt of these the deer they you know they just have to deal with it it's crazy um, so let's get out there there's some good shots to be got with the frost everywhere it's the first hard frost of the year so uh, yeah let's get going and see what we can find much more is gonna show um, this side of the castle I have got one more spot I'm gonna try just the far side of the castle and um, we did get that one shot of the deer so far and I've got uh, lots of frosty morning shots so it's a uh, it's a really beautiful morning and um, so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna skip on over I'm gonna try one more spot uh, before we wrap this up yeah
Alright guys, back in the van here and uh, funny how those things work out, you spend 45 minutes waiting under a tree uh, for some deer or some wildlife to show and you walk back to your van and there is three deer standing behind it so very funny how that worked out. Uh, great to see all the same, uh, very interesting to see one with a broken antler because um, it, it looks quite young, it looks small. Um, so you'd wonder did it get quite boisterous and take on one of the big fellas and uh, really get shown who's boss. So very interesting, you'd wonder what happened there. Um, nonetheless, we are going to go feed the Pine Martin area and I'm going to try to get out uh, as many times this week, uh, maybe at least every second day and to put some peanuts down until we get a nice clear day that I'm off work and we can sit there all day and try to get some good footage of the Pine Martin which I've never got in my video camera. So that's the that's the goal. Um, lovely morning though, like it was uh, hard frost, was down and everything, making everything look like a Christmas card so um, it was really beautiful out there. So I'm gonna go feed the Pine Martin area and uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Alrighty, bye bye.